What's up, YouTube? This your boy JB, and today I'm gonna be door dashing. All right, I got my shoes just in case I gotta run. All right, so this is my first time door dashing. I'm gonna do it for about, I'm gonna do it for like an hour. All right, I just finished coming from training, so um, I just got approved for door dash. I was like, all right, let me check it out, see, you know, see how it go. I asked a couple of my friends how much they make from door dashing because I know a couple people that door dash. They make about 600 to 800 a week, which is not bad. Um, so I'm gonna test it out, do it for about, about an hour. So I'm gonna let y'all record the whole day. Well, not the whole day, but you know, for the hour or whatever. And just to get my feet wet, just to see how I like it. Like I said, I got my shoes just in case I go into a crazy neighborhood and I got run up out of there. You know what I'm saying? So. Let's see how it go. So I got my first order. It was actually super fast. As soon as I hit start dashing, I got one that was literally like four minutes from my house. So I'm on my way there now. Hopefully when I get there, the food done and I do a quick drop off. And hopefully I ain't gotta run. So let's see how I go. All right, so I just picked up the food. Now I'm on the way to the customer. The customer live actually four minutes away from the place they order from, which is real good. So I'm gonna be done this one super fast. Probably in like, well, actually I'm about to pull up to the house now. So in like three minutes, I'll be there. Um, so the first one is pretty good. Like I said, I'm about to go to the house now. Hopefully they're not crazy or nothing, but I'm gonna find it out in a little bit. And I'll be right back. Okay, so I just finished the delivery. It was pretty nice, easy and fast. The instructions was a little crazy though because it said leave at the door. So I'm like, you want me to leave your fool on the steps at the door? Like what if a bug, what if a bug get on it or something? So I mean, but I left at the door, I rang the doorbell. They pretty much came out pretty fast though. By the time I got in the car, they was outside. But um, yeah, it was pretty quick. So I completed that one. Got $4 for that one. That was like three minutes. Literally like three minutes took me to drive. Um, now I got a second one, which is pretty much five minutes away from the one I'm at now. So hopefully this one is like the other one. But like I said, I got my shoes just in case I got to run. Hopefully I don't got to run. Um, see, so I'll be back in a little bit. All right. So I picked the food up for the second order, um, which is not bad. That was literally like three minutes from when I delivered the first one. The place I had to pick up the food was like literally like five minutes, probably like four or five minutes from there. Now I just picked that food up. Now I'm about to drop it off. Um, it's literally a straight shot, like just straight down the street, about seven minutes. So I'll probably get that in about five because it's literally just straight down the street. Um, so, so far, like I said, if they keep banging them out back to back like this, then we're gonna be good. Like after this run right here, I don't know if they're gonna tip me or not, but Without the tip, I'll probably make about $10. So I've been doing it for like 10 minutes. Probably like, I'm only doing it for an hour. Yeah, I started, yeah, like, so like 10 minutes, 10, 15 minutes. So that's pretty much $10 in 15 minutes. So by the time this hour up, like I said, if it keep keeps staying steady like this, then within an hour, I should probably make about like $50 for an hour. And yeah, $50 an hour is not bad. You know, say anything over shit. I mean, if I can hit 20 in an hour, that's still $20 an hour. If you think about it like that. But we're going to see how I go. What's up? I'm on my third one now. Um, I actually, so when you, when they give you a request to do one, you can accept it or decline it. One was going to take me like uh, downtown. So, I mean, not really downtown, but it was going to take me closer to downtown so i kind of uh declined it but as soon as i declined i got another one which actually was better because it paid more only like 50 cent more but they were trying to give me five dollars for downtown and then the one the new one they gave me was 550 so that was actually i made out better on that one all right so i just finished my last run for the hour i did five in an hour which wasn't bad um i ended off with twenty dollars and twenty five cent a lot of the runs was pretty close i mean a lot of the stores 
already had the food done, and a lot of the spots was like literally like five, five six minutes away from the um, from the food place. So I mean, if you think about doing DoorDash, I think it's pretty good. I might actually go for another hour because that hour was super fast, and everything was super close. So you know, time was kind of flying, but um, I might go for extra hour. But the good thing about DoorDash is you know like if i want to just stop go home for a little bit and then come back out or whatever i can so but more likely i'll probably do another hour at least one more um until i get like bored or something but if you like this video give it a thumbs up like comment subscribe if you got any questions and see you at the next one